Hey guys, it's Philip here, and I'm going to be teaching you how to make a TNT cannon. So, first of all, I am in creative, so don't really care if you're making fun of me or anything. I just, it, I think it's easier to do this in creative. So, you need two things of cobblestone going down nine blocks then you need to put a block here and a block here and a block here I put a block over the first opening because it helps me not put TNT on the water source because you have to have a water source in this because if you put it over the water source it'll stop and you don't want that which I'm gonna use a button for this but you can use a lever I think it's easier to use a button on this one but some of them are easier to use a lever, which I'll be showing you something, but I can't tell you right now. It's going to be a surprise on our next tutorial, and I said that wrong. And I'm going to be showing you something on the next tutorial of, uh, it's uh, not really a cannon, but it's a uh, another firing weapon, like uh and yes, it involves a dispenser because I was practicing with it. And I still haven't found any comments that say, uh, go try this to make you stop lagging. So if you guys would just do that, um, please do because I'm it's kind of hard to show you guys what I'm doing when I'm lagging like this. But if you guys just don't have any ideas, uh, don't worry about it. Just uh, try and keep along with the lag. Um, so now that we did, we got to put water there because it makes it so it doesn't blow up all your cobble. Because if it blows up all your cobble, you're, uh, it's not going to set the... It's just going to destroy your redstone and you won't even be able to fire it. So... You gotta put the button right on the back of this block. Then you need to put um, redstone right there. Needs to go down uh, almost all of these blocks. Um, you gotta do make it to the one before. If you do that, then uh, you're gonna mess it up. And, um, some, somebody was trying to put a self-reloading uh, TNT cannon, but it does not work, right? He couldn't even get it to work, so don't even listen to that guy. I don't have his name right now. I will probably put it down in the next episode. He didn't even know what he was doing himself, so don't even go looking for him. Come see me. Then you gotta put, um, so you put all that there. Then you gotta go to the next side and lag. Okay, then you gotta put the redstone on this corner. Then you gotta get. Oh no, hang on. You gotta put one down here. It's gotta be down here, and then you gotta bring it back up, or it'll explode. These uh, repeaters will explode. gotta put them um, all the way down and leave two blocks I think at the end and I did purposely aim this at that tree because I want you guys to sort of see this the damage it can do but sometimes it misfires and shoots way high but yeah sometimes it does that not always though put one more then you got to put a redstone down here and here and here. Then you got to put all these back 
I put them back one or two. I put them back one usually. Um, it they say it fires faster if you put it back all the way back, but I don't really see a difference. I mean, it doesn't look any different to me. I think it shoots just as fast, just as far. And I know there is different cannons, but I believe this is the easiest one to make. And I think it's the less, the least complicated. Um, and I know some people have been, like, making pirate ship ships. I know this probably isn't the most uh, efficient thing to use on a pirate ship, but it will work. So first, you gotta, hang on. Crap, stupid lag. Gotta make sure you don't cover up that water source in there. It's gonna mess the whole thing up. So I gotta be really careful about that. Then when you, you gotta when you put this on the slab, um it's going to float. And that's what it's supposed to happen. And yeah, so I'll fire it off and show you guys what happens. Hopefully it works. Because uh I've only practiced this a couple times before I started recording. And I hope it works. Let's uh, push this button. Okay, that's all good. Gotta light that bad boy. Oh, crap. Where did it all happen? Oh, um. This redstone has to go. One more. Then it goes. Like that, because it's got to go directly into the TNT. This one has to light, or it will not work, right? So if it doesn't light, you should just back off, because it could kill you. If you're on survival. I, I like to do it in creative, when I'm building it. So... Like, it doesn't kill you if it misfires, if you're just practicing. But once you get it down-packed, like, you can just do it in survival if you'd like. But I just started practicing this today. This is, like, the second time I've built it. So, uh, bear with me. I think it'll work this time if I can get over this stupid block. Okay, light it. Now, let's see if that, that back one, oh, yeah, see, it sits onto the slab, and it fires it up. It went over the tree. And, no, well, I don't know if you guys saw that because of my lag, so I'll do it again. Just one more time. Gotta set it up. And this lag makes it hard to set it up. So if there's a mistake, it's not my fault. It's the lag from QuickTime Player. Which you guys should really um, comment and tell me something. Because I'm tired of making you guys uh, suffer from this. Um, hang on a second. It's stupid lag. There. See how it, it has to light or it's not going to work. Where'd it go? Oh, it probably fired straight up. Um, yeah, sometimes it fires straight up, and sometimes it destroys your redstone. Um, I don't know why it keeps messing up, but a lot of people use, um, 
obsidian too to do this but I think uh, cobblestone works just as good if your water's set up right so if your water's set up wrong that's why it keeps getting destroyed see none of my redstone's been destroyed yet because I set it up right finally took me a long time to get it right so don't get agitated if you don't uh, get it right the first time because you can always try again and again until you finally get it right and um this can also, well, something like this can also work for uh, TNT fireworks, I think is what it's called. Think, hang on, I'll show you in a second. Just let me light this one more time. I, th I think this is really fun. Hang on, let me, let me push the button. Button! Me know what's going up. It's going up. Where'd it go? I don't know. Um, I think this lag is what's doing it. But I taught you guys how to build it, and if you build it just same way I did, it should be correct. But if it doesn't work, then um, you did something wrong, not me. Um, so yeah, that's the end of this TNT cannon tutorial bye oh um you can shorten this too but it doesn't work as well so use nine to ten blocks bye